in this problem, we are asked to evaluate the numerical expression 3 fifths minus 2 fifths times 5 sixths. In order to evaluate this expression, we will have to remember the order of operations. In the order of operations, we will do parentheses and exponents first, followed by multiplication and division going from left to right, and then we'll finish with any addition and subtraction, also moving left to right. Therefore, in our numerical expression, 3 fifths minus 2 fifths times 5 sixths, we will recognize that we have to do multiplication before subtraction. Therefore, we could put our parentheses around 2 fifths times 5 sixths to illustrate that. When we multiply 2 fifths times 5 sixths, we can multiply the numerators and denominators. Therefore, 2 fifths times 5 sixths is the same as 2 times 5, or 10, over 5 times 6, which is 30. Then we can simplify 10 thirtieths to give us 1 third. Therefore, our numerical expression is equivalent to 3 fifths minus 1 third. Now, in order to subtract these two fractions, we must find the common denominator. The common denominator between 5 and 3 would be 15. Therefore, we need to rewrite 3 fifths and 1 third with a common denominator of 15. We would recognize that in order to get 3 fifths with a common denominator of 15, we would multiply both numerator and denominator by 3. Likewise, to get the fraction 1 third with the common denominator of 15, we would multiply numerator and denominator by 5. Therefore, 3 fifths minus 1 third is equivalent to 9 fifteenths minus 5 fifteenths, which results in 4 fifteenths, giving us our answer D.